letters of the alphabet. I is for Impala. Impala is a delicate, attractive antelope, easily identifiable by their reddish-brown coat that gradually gets lighter as you reach its underbelly, which is pure white. They have a hunched back and are prone to tucking their tails in tightly against their backsides. They also have a black line which runs down their backs to their tails. The males are noticeable by their long, strong horns, which are very useful during the mating season between January and May, when rivaling builds up between them. And they'll resort to threatening displays and horn thrusting in attempts to assert their dominance. The impala spend much of their time grazing on grasses and shrubs, and usually stay quite close to water, especially during the dry season when they must drink daily. The females are recognized by the fact that they have no horns. They tend to form herds of 10 to 50, and sometimes even more, wandering in and out of male territory. Unfortunately, impalas are popular prey and have many enemies. When a predator comes close, they scatter in all directions, deliberately trying to cause chaos and leave the hunter confused. In full stride, the impala can leap heights of up to 3 meters and distance up to 12 meters. When young, the impalas stay close to their mothers until reaching maturity at a little over a year old. The young males are evicted from their mother's groups when they are six months old, staying around the edge of the herd until they join a bachelor group. Let's take another look at these graceful animals in full stride. Listen to this. When there are a number of babies in a herd, the mothers stand together and gather all the little ones in the middle of the herd, almost like a nursery school. In the great outdoors, it's all about survival of the fittest, and the young ones need all the help they can get. Mm -hmm.